guys and welcome back. Today I'm continuing on the tradition of trying weird and wonderful skincare items. Today I have this, the Comodo Suction. I purchased this from Amazon for the grand price of $39.99, which is the equivalent of 50 US dollars. It's quite pricey considering I have no idea if it's gonna work, how it's gonna go. I'm hoping I can even open the box. I will stab it with some tweezers and we're in. We're in. Don't hit yourself. God. We have the operational manual thank you card, which is quite sweet. If you like our products, leave us a positive review and feedback for this product. Thank you, have a great day. We've got the main suction device. One, two, three, four different attachments, I guess you'd say. There's a USB cable for it as well. I'm gonna go through the manual, figure out how to use the Comodo suction device. Microcrystalline Comodo suction device has functions of skin smoothing, acne removing, skin firming, pore cleansing, and Comodo suction. The probe with microcrystalline particles has a large surface area and with high absorption. This probe can massage and exfoliate skin. That feels quite rough to me. The thought of using that one on my skin does scare me a little bit. Big size circular form probe has the characteristic of strong suction. Small size circular form probe suction is weaker. This has less suction than the big ol' holy one. So if you've got a deep blackhead, use that one. If you've got a not so deep blackhead or you've got sensitive skin, it's saying to use the rounded tip. Moving on to the last one, which is kind of like the slanted tip. Stimulate the micro circulation to operate, prevent the growing of wrinkle. The corner of mouth and other areas were easy to have fine lines. So I'm guessing that's here. I don't know what this micro circulation is that it's talking about. I'm guessing that's me doing this, but it might, might not be. I, I literally have no idea. Luckily guys, for the first time ever, we have a tips page. We have a tips page. Start from your chin, move the device from the bottom up, use on cheek and move it from the inside to the outside. Use from the middle to both sides, like so I'm guessing. Use on T area from the bottom up. Aim at the round hole at the location of the blackhead or acne to remove them. The levels can be changed according to your need. I'm gonna go for it, I'm gonna switch it on. Okay, it's just showing me the battery symbol again. So far it sounds like a microwave. <gasps> I mean like that's, that's pretty, that's pretty <gasps> Gonna go wash that. Let's give it a go. I'm gonna zoom in. Let's just go for it. Oh god, I'm actually quite scared. <gasps> oh, 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 it's stuck. <laughs> but I don't actually know if it sucked anything out. Okay, that is, um, oh, sh that's so stuck. It did nothing. I just feel like I'm putting a vacuum cleaner on my face. Like how long out am I meant to leave it out in one spot for? Because it doesn't really say, ah. I can't tell if anything has come out, you know? My skin is bright red, but I can't actually see much difference. I don't know if it's done anything. <laughs> There's definitely blood coming to the surface on my chin. That does not look good. Mm. Mm. It's stuck. Ow! <laughs> oh, that really hurt. That one really, really hurt. I'm gonna go in with this on my nose. I really hope 
that I don't screw up my face. So I'm getting quite worried that I've basically just given myself like hickeys all over my chin and that would be a disaster. We've swapped to the smaller head and I'm gonna try that and hope that it's not gonna kill me as much as the bigger heads did. I think medium is a good place to start and let's go for it. I'm not sure how long I should keep it on each section. I'm gonna go back to that bigger suction one and I'm gonna give that a go. This could go horribly wrong. I may lose my nose. I'm just gonna do it on a two and just pray for my nose. Ow, 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 ow. As of right now, I'm not seeing any difference. This area here, which really, really hurt, and I was really worried about it bruising, it's starting to go purple. What have I done? On this side of my nose, I can definitely see a patch of congested pores. I'm gonna try it on number four, and we're gonna hope for the best. I think that might have worked. No false alarm, it didn't work. We've tried the big nozzle and we've also tried the small nozzle. I've bruised my chin and I feel like my nose is now really lopsided. What have I done? Basically, it was a complete disaster. That is so bruised. It is literally going purple. This is a disaster. Oh my god. I'm gonna give it one more chance. I'm gonna try it between my brows. I'm gonna give it the benefit of the doubt. Basically, it's a load of It doesn't work. All it does is make my face go bright red and give me bruises. I just threw $50 down the drain and gave myself bruises all over my face. Winner. So here's where I'm at. I've still got sebaceous filaments in my nose. I've still got clogged pores and I now have facial bruises to go with it because this is going even darker by the minute. And I'm not sure how much concealer it's gonna take to cover that up because I'm guessing it's gonna be quite a lot. Moral of the story, this does not work. This will bruise you. This will make your skin turn purple and it will not get rid of your sebaceous filaments or your blackheads or your clogged pores. It will just give you pain with added pain. On that note, I'm gonna say goodbye because my face really hurts right now. I feel like I've given myself a headache. Don't forget to subscribe and give this video a huge thumbs up and and if you have any suggestions for any more weird products that you'd like to see me try, then do let me know in the comment section down below. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!